Welcome back to another crypto researcher video. Today we're going to look at Suka. If you haven't heard of it, just go on Twitter and look under any tweet. They'll be in the comments. The shillers are completely relentless on this one. They're literally everywhere. And if you ask them anything about Suka, they'll say, go do your own research like they know something, which frankly, since I've been looking a little bit into this, I highly doubt they know anything. Okay, because I've gone to the website. Wait, let's go, first go back here. $65 million market cap. And, you know, just under a million of volume. Now, this is the website. It's got a logo. It's got seven sentences. And it's got 12 links. Most of them going to explorers, an email link, a bunch of social media links. And it's just trying to be very mysterious, this website. Now, the problems. If we hit on Discord, we have a broken link. Discord's a bit finicky so though sometimes, so that could just be me trying to get on there, but I doubt it. Now, if you go on Medium, another broken link. Now, Medium's kind of important because there's no other information on this website, so some Medium articles would be quite nice. You know, like they could fill in some information. They could do that research that the Twitter, you know, people keep telling you to do. And let's go to Instagram. Oh, yes, it's a broken link again. Yeah, that's what you expect from a $65 million market cap with, you know, nothing on the website except for 12 links. You want three of them to not work. Now, their YouTube, it basically, it goes into explaining some sort of story that Ryoshi created this after uh, he left Shiba Inu, which he's the creator of Shiba Inu. He got like banished or kicked out. I'm not exactly sure about that, but... The idea is he created Suka as some sort of reward for the worthy people. So he created this whole um, Easter egg hunt kind of of clues and hints that all fit together like a puzzle to show that this is Ryoshi's new project and that, you know, he's going to strike lightning twice like Shiba Inu and smash it out the park again. But if, you know, he's, he's created this idea and he's methodically been planning this out for months and months then why you know is there youtube videos that launch one month after it's on coin market cap to explain everything to everyone like kind of takes the whole easter egg hunt thing out of context you're not really doing it at that point with that so it, it seems a bit weird and then if you're so methodical and you're planning this out, you know, and you've got all the details under control, why are there broken links on your website? And it's only got 12 links. There's nothing else on this website. You can go up and down. This, this is it. You know, it's only got 12 links. And you might say, okay, maybe, maybe these links just broke right now. And the dev's really busy doing loads of important things, and he's going to fix that. But let's go to their Telegram, which I have here handily ready. Okay. And let's just search, I don't know, broken link. What could possibly come up? Okay. Oh, look at this. 12th December. So that's like 40 days ago. Hello, admins. The medium link icon on the website needs to be linked to this. Right now, it's broken. Hmm. So 40 days ago on this website, it's basically barren and only has 12 links. We know that the medium link, the most informative link, is broken and doesn't go anywhere. And it's still broken right now. So honestly, why is there $65 million in here? Like, this is wild. This is absolutely wild. I can think of a bunch of other projects where you can invest your money and it doesn't come with this kind of risk. And, you know, okay, let's just let's just think about something else. Um, the, the Twitter people, they're always telling you, do your own research. Let's go look for the white paper. You know, what could happen? Because let me tell you, it's it's not in the 12 links. So, and you can't find it on CoinMarketCap. Okay, so. Let's take a second for this one. I put white paper. Suka is always evolving. A white paper is pointless. Now, if those aren't words of wisdom, 
Wow. I don't, I don't even know what to say about this. Okay, so yes, is this is this Ryoshi's, you know, thing? I don't know. I, a part of me, like I've got no evidence for this, but a part of me just believes that Ryoshi has just gone fully off the grid. He's just in India somewhere meditating and doing yogi things and, you know, spiritual stuff. And he hasn't got access to the internet. And somebody has noticed that this guy's MIA and that, you know, he's deleted all his tweets. He's not interacting with anyone. He's just, you know, gone to live in the mountains for 10 years. People do that, uh, you know, I don't know. I don't know who does that, but actually I met one or two people that did that. Um, but he's done, I think he's done that. And someone's just decided, I'm going to make this, this story about Ryoshi and his second coming. Everybody loves Shiba Inu. I'll make a lot of money by telling them that Suka is Shiba Inu and I'll put very little information out there because apparently the less information there is, the less holes can be popped into it. You know, like people can't figure out everything's wrong with it if there's no information about it. <laughs> That's my theory. Now, I hope I'm proven wrong, but you know, this is pretty wild how this website has literally nothing. Now, if you think I'm wrong, I understand. Maybe just buy $10 of this. This is not financial advice, even though I, I wouldn't advise to do that. But if it is an ex Shiba Inu, Shiba did at one point, you could invest $10 in Shiba and it would turn into four to six million dollars in 10 months. It's absolutely crazy. So $10 would be enough. But honestly, I can point you in the direction of a couple other things that would be a lot better than this. Like the last video I did about Fat Cat, I really like it. It's a micro cap. 150,000. I think it's got a lot further to go. There is actual information and a website without broken links and they have a plan. You know, it doesn't seem like there's a plan here in this Suka thing. <sighs> this website kind of annoys me, it's especially with the broken links. Like, oh my God. Okay. I think that's enough for this video. Uh, if you're part of the Suka community, I just, I hope you can just look at these criticisms with an open mind. I know everybody gets very cultish and protective over their cryptocurrency, but this doesn't look good. Like three broken links out of 12 links, there's no other information. And you guys don't even have a white paper or anything like crypto researcher out.